okay i don't know what it is but i have a lot of energy right now i actually um which is amazing i feel i feel really good i just uh had this like sudden urge to just clean my room spring cleaning um you know i have the tendency of like getting emotionally attached to like things um you know like things like i mean like i feel like everything holds like a memory you know behind it so um like for my travels like random things that like i i brought with me um um i'm trying to think of an example um okay like for example movie tickets like you know like uh, import like or, or just in general tickets right like tickets to like things that like you had a really good time with like i i used to i used to hold on to it and over time i've gotten much better at it but um i think that like i used to be more emotionally attached to things but i think now as time went on i, I switched over to like getting attached to the utility utility of things like just hoarding things just in case you would need them so right now i was going through my drawers and in my defense like two years traveling like i would go, i would come back i would never really go through my stuff i would just like toss things in and sometimes my mom would use my desk so sometimes she would add things in and uh yeah it was just a, an absolute mess so it's funny like i had like um like hair bands from back when i used to have like long hair i definitely will not be needing any hair bands uh, anytime in the future um rest in peace hairline but uh yeah i just had these like things like lying around and i decided that i wanted to like get rid of a lot of these things because like my my desk uh, drawers were just so crowded and i had like this little bag i started tossing things in and i was as i was going through this stuff like initially it was like okay like just like trash stuff but then i started coming across like things that are like that i would probably need that are functional um like for example like i just had like all these like highlight highlighters 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 and like pens and pencils like i came across like my pouch okay this is a perfect example i found my pouch from uh like my pencil case my my, my pouch from like back when i was in university it had like my lead pencil it had like a pen it had this like scantron pen which was really really interesting um it was like this like thick lead pen that allowed us like fill in scantron so i i even had uh, i even found those and uh, i was like no i can't throw this out like so i kept one i had two of them i kept one in this like memory box like i i i do have still have shoe boxes with like all these random memory items i haven't done one in a long time uh i just like put this together just to like toss some important things in uh but then the rest of the stuff i just started like tossing out and then when i got into the the rhythm of it i just started like tossing all these things out um like for example never would have thought that i would toss a really beautiful iphone box out like uh, that one kind of hurt i'm not gonna lie it's just like so pretty it just it feels like the box itself is an object that you're supposed to hold on to then i tossed out like my my like uh, my airpods box that one hurt as well uh and then like just like all these like random things i had like i had like this full geometry set that could probably use but i'm like no i want to toss it out and i think that like what we should probably i don't know if this i don't know if it's possible like just uh like donate all these like little things like they're all just like small like i had this like pair of like kind of like bluetooth earphones that i bought like way back when i was in like probably like before i even started university like back in like 2015 or something <laughs> and i just like all i did was like toss them in my bag and um my dad's like uh my mom and dad they're gonna look they said they're gonna look through stuff and like take whatever they need because i there are some <coughs> things that are useful but <coughs> i feel like i just swallowed a fly but as i toss these things out like i feel so like free and like uh yeah like my I, I just feel like my environment feels a lot lighter um you know like just getting rid of like duplicates of the same thing like if i have two black pens like i don't need two black pens i'll just i'll just toss one out um and sometimes it hurts doing this because like these are things that you could use um some of these things like you might even need in the future like for example um you know like uh like erasers uh, like i could possibly use them in the future but like i just don't need four of them i'll just keep one um and then like all these like random things i just i don't need them i'm not gonna need them anytime soon and if i need them like they're they're like cheap enough to like just buy it but right now like just because i have like limited storage space like i just have like one one like uh 
set of drawers that I can put things in and that's like at my desk and I'm always I'm opening it every single day and I don't want to keep like being overwhelmed with the amount of junk that's in there so yeah I'm just gonna like I like I tossed it out I, I feel like my my mom especially my dad a little bit they also tend to get emotionally attached to like things but um they just don't need this stuff uh and I, and I feel like I want to live life more like a minimalist um and like I think that like when I have my own place when I kind of like start from scratch then it's gonna be interesting because I'll be so mindful about the things that I buy and the things I hold on to if you don't need it either trash or donate it um so yeah this is uh I feel really great doing this uh, I feel a lot lighter and uh yeah I think that I'm gonna spend probably the rest of the day just like cleaning things up um like i I need to clean my shoes which I've been loafing on I tossed my laundry in the in the I tossed my dirty laundry into the laundry and uh, I would like to clean the car today as well because that that thing is a mess but I also want to like, kind of change my desk layout I came across this tweet the other day it was like uh, about how like I don't know what the size behind this is but they're like your like your desk should be facing your room like it should never be facing the wall <laughs> I don't know the science behind this but I'm just like I just I just thought about it. I was like what if like my desk was like facing my room instead of my wall and I'm like honestly like I want to try it out because right now like my desk is like my windows are behind my like monitors and I don't like it because there's light coming from outside and then it's just whereas like if I change my desk layout then like my window will be on the side and then my de my like monitors will be facing the room and it'll kind of close off like one section of my room to just become somewhat of like an office so I want to I wanna mess around with that. I want to see, like, what that can look like. Because, uh, yeah, I, could, that, I think that could be interesting. But, uh, yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. It's time for transformation, man. And um, one of the steps that I decided to take for that is unloading. Just, like, all this trash filled stuff I don't need. And uh, now I feel a lot lighter. Let's go. I just, I hope that this excitement continues to stay. I know it won't. It never does. The excitement, the motivation, ebbs and flows, right? It comes and goes, but, whoa, that kind of rhyme. Ebbs and flows, it ebbs and flows, it comes and goes. Maybe I should become a rapper. <laughs> All right. Gotta get back to work.